Okay, guys, so we have a problem. We have a big problem. This broke off while I was cleaning it, and I don't know if it will work. So we'll have to try and put the GoPro on it and see if it holds. But if not, yeah, this this, this sucks. Hmm. Damn it. I blame you for this. Me? Yeah. Because it is. Oh, gosh. <laughs> you hit our crack. I'm going to We'll go. I actually have my cup today. What is up guys? Welcome back to another video. So it turns out that where we planted the shadow Benny and Sive, the sun has been scorching our plants a little too much. There's not much shade there. Just the Sive. The yeah. shadow Benny is okay. Yeah, so we're just gonna replant the Sive somewhere else. And I actually bought some other plants. So we're gonna show you guys that in a bit and find a nice place to put them. Also, the dirt where we plant. <laughs> Wow. Fall in my cup. <laughs> oh my gosh. That wasn't planned. Wow. <laughs> this tree, this tree doesn't like us, yo. <laughs> yeah, the, the soil just does not have a lot of nutrients in it as well. So I also got some soil. So we'll see you guys there. Okay, our little fence we built last time. If you saw that video, I'll actually put the link somewhere up in this corner here. They don't look too bad though. You look at this. This not looking good. This gone. This well, that like one needs dying. a little help. Yeah, guys, you and see what I what I mean by how hard and dry the dirt is that's why we need to move these guys look at this thing yeah going that's here. actually growing good this one is growing nice okay so we're gonna move these things and we will see you guys in a bit look how look how nice the fence dried out though and it's, it's really steady like i knew that was gonna happen that the vines were gonna get tight and yeah you see you see this the sun is just killing them so they're in sun right through yeah we definitely have to move our side oh it's so windy today wow oh. <laughs> okay guys we're gonna have this our side because look how long this it's got. have grown so much Look at how much side we got. This is a lot. Yeah. Wow. What, what's this little thing? You see, guys, okay. good to grow your plants yourself. I mean, and we salvaged this from some side that we bought in the grocery. And all you do is cut it like this and plant it. And look at how much side we have. Yeah, there's plenty. Yeah. This little orange tree is taking its time, boy. But this leaf is much longer than it was before. Yeah. I mean, this one taking its time. Nothing yeah. came out of this. Like nothing came out of this. Another orange tree that we put down a while after. But Sive guys, so cool. I'm really impressed. Let's this go will check go up. good with our seasoning. Yep. So I got this from one of my mom's plant pots. It's a device to slow water the plants so that you don't have to always water the plants. Or I guess if you can't water the plant for an entire week, you just yeah. fill this up. There's a little water lying in there. There's if you still shake water it, you'll see. In there. Yeah. So the soil will just take water from there and feed it straight to the roots. If anyone knows the name of this, I don't remember the name. Leave it in the comments. Okay guys, so we got the green season from the yard, so we just picked it. We have some garlic and we're just gonna chop this up, blend it up and make some green seasoning. Okay, so we went out and got some plants to do some planting. Yeah, all new seedlings. Well, except except this one. I planted this seed myself. Okay, so let's talk about what we got here. First one. I actually went by one of my friends and harvested some shadow benny from his backyard and I decided to plant them and we have more shadow benny. Next one. What do you think this is? Watermelon vine. Yeah. Nope. No? Cucumber. Oh. Right, so this is cucumber. We got some thyme from our neighbor. Got some pimento and the rest of these should be hot pepper. I got all these as seedlings. Uh, another cucumber here. Yeah. This one here, this is rosemary. You just have to touch the leaf and smell your finger and the scent comes off pretty strong. Really nice. These are some weeds that the um, plant guy said will fertilize, help fertilize the plant. And this type of plant actually keeps away bugs and stuff because of the strong scent. So we have watermelon here. These ones I planted from seeds. We have a little lettuce. I don't know if you see it. Little cute things. Yeah. And we have a little celery here. Alright, so we're gonna take these across to their spots and either lay them down, change pots, or plant them straight into the soil. Oh, we have some soil. 
Okay guys, if you're wondering where I got all my seedlings from, there's a really nice plant shop called A Cup of Garden on St. Lucian Road. It's actually opposite Blue Range, next to the little grocery as soon as you bend the corner. They have lots of different seedlings and they all cost a dollar. And I just thought the service there was amazing, so I might go back there and get some more seedlings. And the guy is very nice, so check out A Cup of Garden on St. Lucian Road. So this is our bag of soil that we got at the plant shop. Guys, yeah, it's also a bag. The soil is really nice and dark. You got lots of different things in here. I'm not sure if mine is in here because they don't smell bad, but I'm pretty sure. Mm. Lots of different compounds that make up a healthy soil. Yeah, and this is where we're going to be laying out our plants. This yes. is old plants that my mother had here. We might yeah. use this big pot for the peppers. Big and nice. I like how high off of the ground it is so it'll break your back watering plants. Yeah, true. These trays were lying around in the yard. They seem to be old plant pots. So we might use these to put, I was thinking these side, if we could like run them along here. Yeah, what do you guys think? That's good. Woo! Again, guys, if you all have any planting tips, put it in the comments. Don't forget to check out our other videos on the channel. Thanks again for all the subscribers, guys. Cross a thousand. That's amazing. We wouldn't be able to do it without you guys. So thanks for the support. We appreciate all of it. Buttons already start before us. You digging before us? They're just going to move out all these plants. If she can lift it. She's been working out. Yeah. Oh, nice. lift it. Of course she can. So we're just gonna clear this area a little bit here so we can see what we're working with. So we can lay down our plants, yeah? Wow, she's doing all the heavy lifting. Why are you always? Good job. I always do not do <laughs> <laughs> I like to see you work. She likes to test her fitness, so this is a good way. Let's lift some heavy pots, yeah? I don't need that heavy. <laughs> <laughs> wow, don't don't trip and fall now. You need some help? No, that's okay. Oh, yeah, I think I you, yeah, you do. You destroyed that. <laughs> yeah, you hold this. Let me get some. I can't make you do all your work. Hi <laughs> guys. You have all these muscles for nothing. <laughs> oh guys, look at this. Just look at this for a sec. All of these here are little wonders of the world plants. They're like weeds up here. Wait, you know, we could plant some of that, huh? We could actually because we have healthy soil now and they will thrive. They only look so small and stay miniature because the soil isn't good and there's too much stones here. Because I actually planted one of these and they're so huge. They get it's huge. Yeah, it's almost as tall as me. Yeah, so we'll keep this one. Is this one good to plant? Actually, yeah, it is. It have, it have divine. <laughs> divine? <laughs> the roots. The roots, the roots, I mean. <laughs> let's, um, let's keep That's them it. aside. Oh, by the way, if you don't know what Wonders of the World is, it's a, it's a healing plant and you can actually rub Iodex. Like if you have an uh, injury or something, you can rub Iodex on your foot or on the leaf. Heat the leaf, let it melt, slap the leaf on your foot, wrap it, and it would heal. Also, soft candle works well with soft candle as well, so it's medicinal. You're planting everything that's good for you. Yep. Buttons come out. What kind of insect come is out. this, guys? Come out, come out. That was flying around. Got some interesting wings. Okay, so we had some scythe, a tiny little shadow benny by the kitchen window growing. We're gonna plant them so they could grow nice and healthy. This dirt has so many different things in it. There's, there's old wood, there's charcoal, there's some dark clump, there's some clay, lots of different things. Real healthy soil. This one doesn't have a lot of roots, but some of these we're trying to save because the soil just was not giving them the nutrients they needed. This is probably the healthiest one. A little frail and stuff. Just digging about three quarter way down, putting them in, and we will fill the top with some loose soil. Let's see if we can fit two more in the end here. That's looking, looking pretty good. I'm just gonna fill these empty spaces. Make sure to have enough soil for all the roots to grow. I think that's good. How does that look? That's good. Dance so on my toes. <laughs> so we're going to take out what's in here to plant our peppers. <sighs> Whoa, look at that son of a gun for a root. Hmm. Wow. Hope they have no animals in here. Oh dear. Oh, oh my gosh. Well, it's rusty. Easy. We could have gotten cut. Well, not that bad. It's oh not my gosh. We would. It's a little lizard egg. Yeah, it's all crap. Yeah. Yeah, leave it at home full stuff, right? Yeah. This is why we need gloves when we're planting. You didn't bring your gloves? No. Huh. Guys, we're gonna make sure and get some proper gardening tools because this is unacceptable. This thing is mashing up. And you're just freaking it up, huh? Yeah, so we're gonna get some proper garden tools next time we do a gardening video for you guys.
What is that? A shell. <laughs> broken. A little Very shell. Soft. Everything seems to be broke. Oh my gosh, broken and brittle in here. <laughs> oh guys, just to show you all the size of this pot. This pot is huge. What is that? Two and a half feet deep? How deep is your love? <laughs> Very deep. Right, so we're gonna put our peppers in here. We're just gonna leave it like there and that's how we're gonna leave it. <laughs> of course not. Guys, we clearly need to get more soil. We don't have a lot. Yeah. So we're gonna just put all... all? Yeah. So what about the other things we have to plant? I, I, we need more soil. Mm, it feels so nice. Yeah, it does. These are hot peppers, by the way. Let's gently take them out. Yeah, we could just pop them, right? Try not to disturb them too much. All right, there's one. Yeah, he looks like a center plant. Just dig a hole right there. Right, good, good, good. That deep enough? Yeah, cover it back. <coughs> oh, Excuse bless me. you. That <laughs> yeah. actually looks pretty good. Let's just plant one plant in there. That looks real good. What do you think? Yeah. <laughs> How was that scale? He looks lonely. You have Aww. to put the rest. This was in the soil. But they look very nice inside of here. Yes, they look very nice. <laughs> yeah, look at it. So adorable. So, what do you guys think? Check it out. One of these or two of these are pimentos. I got it free from the um, the pet guy. Check out a cup of garden, St. Lucian Road. And the rest are hot peppers. So, let's see what happens. Let's see if they live. Yeah. We actually going to try to mix our soil from the plant pots with the good soil. So, we could plant our cucumber. Look at the difference. <laughs> <laughs> We have our cucumbers here. Yeah, so there's one guy in there. Squeeze it a little bit, tap the base. Squeeze, squeeze, tap. Dig out <laughs> like the same amount of space, like this. Wiggle the pot like that. Move it gently and replace it with this pot. Just like that. Ain't that cool? Has some good soil in there. I just thought of that all by myself, guys. We still have to see how we could find more soil to do the other things. Well, I'm gonna call this George for the day. What? We need more soil. We do, but not today. We'll see how things go. I think that's good enough. Yeah, this looks nice. It's so pretty. I know what's prettier. Our peppers. Yeah. Look at it. So nice. I hope they grow. Me too. Soil looks so good though. I know what's even better. Our side. Nothing's better. Everything's good to grow. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna transplant this little guy here. There's the orange into this bigger pot right here. We forgot we had this. We yeah, boy. We forgot we had all this soil we put here. <laughs> what? What? Did you just break something? Don't worry about that. Hmm. Okay, no. There we go. <laughs> you know, guys, it's good to plant a plant mm. a happy little tree, and then you can plant more happy little trees. And we want happy little trees yeah. all over. And just give them friends, you know, because sometimes trees need friends. You know? Right. <laughs> Hashtag Bob Ross. Hashtag Bob Ross. Excellent paint on YouTube. Check him out. Good. That looks nice. Oh, he is gonna be full with plants. He's gonna go in the back by the other shot of Benny. Yeah, he have to be with his family. Rosemary smells so good. Don't mess it up. Nice little spot here for this guy. Oh, that fits good, right? Yeah, it does indeed. Very new leaves, though. Yeah, no, don't worry about that. Just make a home for the cellar, you know. Oh, is this little thing just? <laughs> it's a little piece of um wood I put with it just to help support it. But oh, it... you put that in? Yeah, but it don't need it. We could actually lodge it in the soil. Yeah, just leave it there. Dead wood, that kind of thing helps plants. Oh yeah, guys. We're recently learned that earthworms are fantastic for the growth of your plants and your soil so in another video we are going to be hunting for earthworms yeah, because we, we want as much earthworms in all of our soil and our plants to help them grow and as much nutrients as we could get yeah them. we can get much more nutrient rich soil because the earthworms aerate the soil they create canals and stuff so when you water your plants the water just goes all the way through at least 10 times faster than soil that don't have earthworms. Yeah. Plus, it helps the roots as well. Yeah, so no soil erosion and stuff. And the soil actually has some clay in it as well. It's very soft feel. Yeah, it feels nice. This soil is packed with so much good nutrients, the plants. Yeah, let's get the other one in there. Lettuce. I don't even know what type of lettuce this is, guys, but it's lettuce. Uh, yeah, it looks like lettuce, so it's lettuce. <laughs> yeah, but what kind? It's okay. When it grows more, we'll know, I guess. <laughs> Anyone knows what kind of lettuce this is, please let us know because yeah. we are not too sure yeah i just i just bought seedlings so yeah they're so evenly apart it's crazy oh you want a metal yes i do okay. <laughs> i want a sweetie a lollipop anything like that well we have some chocolate in the fridge too. oh yeah but well, that's my chocolate though that's our chocolate yeah. Oh wow, chocolate. Mm -hmm. New plants, guys. It looks so presentable. We have to plant our time because time is very running important. Yeah. <laughs> time, time is running out. Time, time. time is running out. <laughs>
Guys, look at that old watermelon. Oh my gosh, get closer. Look at the size of these leaves. Yeah, they're growing nice. Wow, they look better than these. Well, let's put them all together. Dig, man, dig. Now we're talking. Oh gosh, call them wood with it. That's yeah. good stuff. <laughs> we'll get some earthworms in here, maybe. Hopefully. Yeah, we earthworms have to like a lot of dead leaves and compost stuff. Yeah. Yeah, dead roots and stuff. So if you want earthworms in your soil to help them <laughs> make your soil nutrient rich. Yes. Yeah, that's good. All right, so we'll come now, water this later. Now for these to grow nice and big like these. So, so look at these guys. In our last video, they were not this beautiful. <laughs> yeah, all the leaves were rounded. If you can remember, they were very tiny, tiny. Oh my gosh. Gonna plant this too. No. Okay guys, there you have it. Our peppers. Our new scythe. Cut how good that looks, guys. Our orange she has a bigger plot. A bigger plot. <laughs> bigger plot so our roots can grow. We got our rosemary, celery, our lettuce. And we just stuck the thyme in there and hopes that it will grow. Because it's kinda weak, you know? And we got our cucumbers. That about wraps it up, yeah? Okay guys, so we hope you guys enjoyed this video. We hope you start planting. Please like this video if you did. And don't forget to share this video with a friend. Subscribe. Click the bell to be notified for more videos in the future. And as always guys, stay safe, stay, stay adventurous. adventurous.